Oh my god, they literally made a vanity here. Ooh, they have makeup. I always have to stop by this section. Oh my god, how much is this one? Welcome back to another video my Pita Chips. I hope you guys are having a great day. Today's gonna be a vlog edition. I did a poll on YouTube community and I asked you guys if you guys wanted me to do like a vlog video and you guys said yes. So here I am. I'm starting off the day at Target because I have a couple things that I need to return and then I'm gonna see if they finally have Makeup Geek here in my Target because if you guys did not know, there is rumors that Makeup Geek is now online on Target but I wanna make sure to see if they have it in stores and maybe I can buy something and test it out but today's video is gonna consist of me going to Ikea because I have been wanting a vanity for the longest and I think today is going to be the day where I purchase a couple things and I can build my own dream vanity so we're gonna go from there on so without any further ado let's get the first errand out of the way and let's go into Target All right guys, so we're in the makeup section and I'm looking around to see if maybe I can see it. Usually they would have it like on the sides if it's something that's like new. But they have magnetic lashes here, so that's not it. Over here, no, Positions Formula, Wet and Wild. Okay, I don't think they have it, let me see. No, this is Wet and Wild and NYX. That's Profusion. Uh, I don't think they have it guys. They don't have it. Number seven, number seven, soap and glory, mask. This is skincare, lashes, nope. Well, that's a bummer. They don't have it, guys. If you wanted to try these Maybelline Python Metallic Lip Kit, but if you really think about it, it just comes with like this, a metallic powder in the lip color, which honestly, I have like a lip color like this and I can just put like a gold shadow on top instead of paying the $8. So I think I'll just put it back. But I like the concept of it. It looks kind of cool, especially like the red one. That was nice too. All right, since I'm going to the beach in two weeks, I'm looking for like a straw bag. You know those bags that are made out of straw. I'm looking for one of those. <clears throat> I'm looking for one of those because I really want one. And if I find one right now in Target, I'm gonna get it. Well, I mean, if it's not like $30, I'll for sure get it because I already tried going to the thrift store and tried to find one and I can't find it. So we're on a mission right now, guys, to find a straw bag. Okay, I found this one, but it's literally like super tiny. Like that's how little it is. And it's $24.99. 99s? <laughs> what did I just say? 24.99. It comes with these little pom poms as well. And it has a strap. Okay, so there's this one, but I'm looking for like a round one. They have that one, but that one's too big as well. Um, this kind of looks like the Gucci bag, right? Let me see. But I found this one. I think I really, really do like this one. And it's 24. No, it's 27.99. It's like three dollars more expensive than the other one. But I think I'd rather take this one versus a small one because the other one's way too tiny. And this one's really cute. I like it. Okay, once you have it on, it looks a little something like this. Obviously, you have to like be dressed up, not like me. <laughs> I look like I'm going to the gym. But this one looks so pretty. I also like it because if I want, I can really just hide like the black material that it has here. And it just looks like just like a straw material. I really like it. And also, you can like adjust the strap so it won't be way too low. But I actually really like this one. It's really cute, especially now that summer's coming up. And for the beach, I think it'll be even better. All right, guys, here comes the exciting part. Now we're gonna go to Ikea and look at everything so I can start building my vanity. I am so excited. Ta -da, we have made it to Ikea. Okay, here comes the fun part, trying to look for everything that I want and hopefully we can find it. All right guys, so the mission is kind of finding a bed with drawers underneath and also the vanity because if I want a vanity, I need to have a bed frame with drawers underneath so I can put all the clothes and I can have enough space for my vanity. So that's the mission for today. Look how cute this background is, I found it. It's really cute. I'm also looking around to see if maybe I find any like decoration wise or anything. But you guys know if I go to Chroma Beauty Room, it's gonna be at what? TJ Maxx and Marshalls. You guys already know it. So I'm gonna keep on looking around. If you find anything that's really cute for like a beauty room, I would definitely show you. Oh my god, they literally made a vanity here. <gasps> what? Are you kidding me? It's just like a mirror with like the little lights. Oh my god, I'm loving this. I like this. I like that they have like this on top as well and the little lights and that. Oh my god. 
what are they? This is an Alex drawer for sure, right? Oh, and look, they put these little boxes in here to like organize everything. Okay, this is nice, and it has these are bigger than this one up here. But I'm gonna keep looking around. But I like this one; it's cute. All right, guys, this is like the big Alex drawer. Like this one has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine drawers, and they go obviously from smallest to like the biggest one. But this one's 159. Yeah, this one has nine drawers. Like I guess I should have read there up there first, but. This is like the ideal, but 160 is a little bit too pricey. But I saw the $80 ones, which are over here. Let me show you. They're 69 or 80. Let's see. 89 for this one. But this one has like a big drawer. I don't think I would like this one because I wanted to organize my makeup. So I think I would do this one, the $80 one that has um, five drawers. You can get it in black or white, but I think I'll go with white. And I like the little organizer that they have here. So 80 if with, with two of these, I get it with what I would buy. One Alex drawer, the 160. So I think I'll go with this one instead. But first, I need to find the bed frame. That's what I need right now. But if you guys are interested in the Alex drawers, there's $79. And then obviously, I would need like a chair too. But these chairs, I don't think they're so cute. So I think I will like go with the stool probably from TJ Maxx or Marshalls. Because I always find some there. This is like the ideal kitchen, guys. It's so beautiful look at this sink <gasps> literally in this kitchen i would want to cook every day not like right now that i'm lazy <laughs> but it's so pretty oh my god one day i'm gonna have a kitchen like this all right guys i think i found the one that we like it's this one and it literally has four drawers and they're huge oh look they have this vanity for 249 with the stool 40 but i'd rather build my own versus this one i kind of wanted a bed frame like that but it's only gonna make it bulkier the room. So no, I think I'd rather just go with the one that I found. Wait, what if I take this one, like open it up, babe? You want me to open it up? Yeah, open it up. Let's see. Oh, snap. Yay, we found the bed and it exactly fits the right measurements because I had to measure to make sure everything was gonna fit correctly. And so far, it's looking like I'm gonna get a vanity. So that's really exciting. Now we have to put up like the bed frame and see how much space I have left. So that way I can really know how big I want my vanity, if I want it really big or I want it kind of small. And then you guys are gonna build it with me and it's gonna be so exciting. If you ever come to Ikea, you know that like the restaurant is the best thing and it's closed. What the heck, what a bummer. I think they're like remodeling. It's temporarily closed for renovation, yeah. Oh, dang it. Looks like I'm not eating here today. All right guys, I'm gonna grab a cart because now we have to go look for the bed frame and we need aisle 30, so over there. We need bed 45, so I'm just gonna, oh! 45, 45, 45, 45. Ah! Oh, there you go. 45, I almost fell. Okay, now I can't find the bed frame, which is stupid, because this is in bin 45. Bin 45, and there's nothing. It's only in black, and I need it in white. <sighs> Sometimes I hate Ikea. It's so frustrating, like, how am I supposed to find my bed in this huge ass storage place? Okay, hopefully I find it. I'll keep you guys posted. Wait, 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 wait. It's supposed to be here. Brims, queen, white, 189. And there's nothing on the floor. Like, how are they gonna do me dirty like that? Have it on display and I have it here. Okay, we have to go check the computer now to see if it's in stock. Because if not, I'm gonna have to order it online and then I have to wait longer and uh, let's just go check. Whoop, just my luck, guys. They don't have it in stock in the store, so we're gonna have to get it online. Wait till it arrives, go did and see how much space I have left. But for now, I'm gonna go into the clearance section, my favorite part of IKEA. They don't really have a lot of stuff this time. Last time I came, I found an Alex drawer and I didn't take it. I should have taken it, but usually they have pretty good stuff, but this time, it seems like they don't have anything. All right, so since I didn't have any luck at Ikea with bed frame and we have to order it online, there's Ross across the street, so I came to Ross to see what maybe we can find here. Ooh, they have makeup. I always have to stop by this section. Oh my God, how much is this one? This one's $13. Okay, this is definitely a great deal with like the brushes and the sponge and they have physician's formula for $7.99 okay i'm not gonna do like a sales and goods but if i find anything cool i'll show you guys all right and i found the nick glitter goals 
for $6.99 and a Buxom, which is interesting. I've never seen Buxom here. For $8.99 and an Elf Little Massaging Eye Wand for $10. Uh, let's see, what else do I see? Juicy Couture Brushes, $9, I mean $8. What else? Elf Brushes for $9.99, oh, $5.99. Wow, I can't read today. And then this whole 11 piece set for $10. Okay, that's definitely a steal. That's really, really good. Okay, so it's not like a seals and deals today, so I just want to show you guys like the coolest things that I found here, but okay. Ross surprised me today. They had good things. Oh my god, I can't believe I found this. Satin velvet for oh, these are 20. Oh my god. Bare mineral shut the heck up. I had never seen all these at Ross. $16 for this one. And we have three of no two of these. A whole bunch of physicians formula for $7.89. What is this? A glowing complexion for $5.99. This is lip more of the next ones. Oh, they're different shades though. That's cool. I've never seen so much good stuff at Ross. That's weird. I thought this was like bare minerals for a second, but it's not. It's from Jasmine LaBelle for $8. Let's see what else. They have all of these lashes for $5.99. Physicians Formula, the Beauty Bar. Uh, let's see. Oh, they have a whole bunch of Physicians Formula up here as well too. And a whole bunch of other makeup that I had never seen. But I'm quite honestly surprised by the stuff that I found. More Physicians Formula. Let's see. What else? I think that's all that we have found. More Physicians Formula. Wow, they have a lot of Physicians Formula, actually. And just a whole bunch of random lippies. Wait, they have Rimmel Mascaras. Two for $8, which is really good. Um, what else? Oh, I have not seen. How did I skip this one? NYX Beauty School brush set for $20. Okay, like, honestly, honestly, I'm really impressed right now because I never find this much good stuff at Ross. Like, this is insane. Like, the fact that I'm finding all of this elf brush set for just $5.99. I kind of want to take these, but I don't know. I feel like I have so many brushes already. But, like, the Morphe subscription, I feel like I get more than enough. <laughs> but it's, like, a really good deal. Let's see what else. Mm, nail polish, cute. Elf, I showed you guys these already, right? All right, they have so many, like, to organize your makeup and stuff. This one is $8, okay? This one is huge. Eight for that one. And then all these organizers for 12 Like, literally, all these for your lippies for $6. Let's see. They have so many. Oh my god, this is so cute. Wait, are these? Oh, these are neon lamps. Shut the heck up. Oh my god, I want a pineapple. How much are these? These are 10. I just discovered that you can try them. Look, this one's green. This one is orange. And the little unicorn is purple. Oh my god, these are to die for. These are so cute and they're literally $10 only. Oh my god, how much is this? A hundred? Okay, this is like so cute. And look at the chair. Oh my god, I'm telling you guys, Ross has like a lot of good stuff. Alright guys, so today was kind of a fail. Also, I'm very sorry. I have my AC running because it is, again, 103 today. So, it was kind of a fail. The bed frame that we wanted, they had it at Ikea, but it was, like I showed you guys, not in stock. So now we have to order it online. We have to wait till it arrives. We have to basically set it all up. See how much room I have left and then I can go buy my vanity and buy like decorations to put up Because since also the bed frame it doesn't have like a headboard I'm gonna put like a small little um, shelf on top so I can put like picture frames and like little LED lights I want to make it really cute so first I have to see how much space I have left and then I can start building the vanity So yeah plus we got to go to Ross we found cute stuff I did not get that straw bag there's a Ross in front of me after I'm done here with the video today I'm gonna go try to find it and if I find it, I will post it on Snapchat. If I don't, then that means I didn't find it. I also really want to go to the thrift store because I know the thrift store has a lot of good finds when it comes to furniture wise. Like you can DIY a lot of different stuff. So I'm all about DIYing. If you guys don't know about me, I love to DIY a lot of things. I just never post DIYs on my channel because I don't know if that's something that you guys would like or I don't know if I will like explain it like 100% good to like where you will understand like what steps I'm telling you so 
That's the reason I don't usually upload like a lot of DIYs on my channel, but I love to DIY stuff, especially when it's so cheap and you can make it into something really cute and make it look really fancy. That's something that I love. But um, that is it for this video, my loves. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. It was like a vlog come along with me just on a random day that we try to go shopping, but it just somehow didn't work out. But I still hope you guys enjoyed this video. I love you guys so, so much. If you're new to the channel and this is your first time seeing my face right here my name is lupita welcome to the channel and i really hope you subscribe so you can be part of the pita chef family i love you guys so so much and i think that's it for this video um for the next video the next time you guys will see me it will be a steals and deals so stay tuned for that and i love you guys so so much i really hope by the next video i feel so much better because for the past this week i've just been feeling so just like drained out but i'm trying my best trying my best to record videos for you guys and because because this is like my getaway time this is what makes me really happy so i love you guys to the moon and back and i will see you guys on the next one bye my loves make sure you're subscribed so you can watch all of my videos and if you want to keep on watching more and more videos make sure to check out yesterday's video you are not going to want to miss it it's amazing also if you want to get to know me a little bit better make sure to subscribe to that vlogging channel right there and if you can't get enough of me here is my spanish channel so you can go ahead and subscribe love you guys so much and i'll see you tomorrow